hello everyone this is Maruf so today I'm going to talk about a little issue regarding a feature in incoming payment on SAP business one so those of you who did not watch my first video regarding SAP business one please check it out on the playlist <coughs> I talk about how you can bypass the trial license period uh, once you have installed the software as you can see below here it says 17 to 2020 so I'm using a trial version for this uh, tutorial so let's get on with what we have planned today so just the other day uh, one of our functional consultants called me up and he said he was facing an issue regarding incoming payment at the client office let me show you what the issue was so this is incoming payment and if we select a customer who will be doing this transaction and go to payment means so the issue they were facing was they couldn't get this drop down to open this is primary form item this is basically the clash uh, ca excuse me cash flow item line item which you can find from here so basically these are the options they were looking for but couldn't get the drop down to open so obviously they were not available so the solution is pretty silly basically the amount here is 1872 so when you have to pay that amount you have to either type it down or press uh, control B at the same time and it shows the amount uh, from the payment means so once that's there this drop down opens so a silly little uh, thing but uh, this is how it's done um, that's all I wanted to show today uh, if you are new to my channel please subscribe if uh, give this video a thumbs up uh, this will motivate me to post more tips and tricks videos on SAP business one and comment down below if you have anything specific you want to see uh, thank you for now